Line managers. What's in your job description? It's a given you're in charge of getting the best from your team. What about security? Do you lead from the front on behaving in a security conscious way? Do you ensure your team is security conscious too? Security in the workplace is more important than ever. People may try to get into your building, hack your IT, even cause harm. They might be criminals trying to get to your accounts, competitors after valuable knowledge or protected IP, even foreign intelligence services vying for information on UK businesses. They target the weakest point, and that can be an unwitting employee. Raising awareness of security is an important part of a manager's job. So, what's the best way of doing this? Take it upon yourself to tell employees about security policy. Make sure your team and every new starter gets the same briefing and always lead by example. It's no good telling others to adhere to good practices if you don't do it yourself. When you brief your employees, don't lecture them or be too formal, otherwise they may not listen. Avoid being too blasé too, or they may think the message is not that important. Be engaging and informative. Prepare some case studies that show employees what sort of attacks can happen and how that directly affects them. Make it personal. Tangible examples of what or what not to do in a security situation bring home to people the role they play in keeping your organisation safe. Keep them topped up. Security policy changes constantly, especially in the digital world. So help your employees stay up to date with these. Get feedback. Do your employees understand the threats they face, how they themselves could be targeted, the consequences of a breach and why security procedures are in place. Give feedback. Let your employees know when they're behaving in a way that could put the security of certain information or organisational assets at risk and advise them of the correct procedure. Be sure that it's constructive though, people learn from their mistakes, so encourage all your team to come to you if they think they've done something wrong. There's no better learning material for your team members than with a real life example to address. And if they're doing something right, let them know with a thank you. Lastly, don't panic, stay calm and be confident. You know what to do in any potential situation. Organisational security is everyone's responsibility. It doesn't need to be complicated, but it all starts with you.